Hello everyone, welcome back to Anonymous World. Hope you are all doing well. So oh, it has been a long time since I uploaded a video. Sorry for that. So today's video is a walkthrough video of a King of the Hill room, which is Hogwarts. So let's see. So I've already started the machine, copied our IP. So let's first make a directory. Okay, so first thing first, our nmap scan. We will do a all port scan. So let's wait for a result. Okay, so after one eternity, our nmap result is there. And let's see. Okay, so several ports are open here. Okay, FTP is running on port 7259, which is kind of weird. FTP usually runs on port 21. And okay, on port 22, instead of SSH, HTTP is running there. 7259 is for FTP. And uh, SSH is running on port 9075. Okay, so all ports are mixed up here and uh, we can see port 47196 and FTP anonymous login is allowed so we can log in into FTP on port 7259 so first let's check out port 22 okay I forgot the port by default it will take 80 so the address is restricted okay so anonymous FTP login is allowed so let's try to log in there and see if we can find something ok FTP then IP then our port ok sorry that's command mistake there is no colon it is written by hyphen P so anonymous and we don't need password sorry again a typo okay so now we are in let's see what we have here okay so we have a text file which is dot i am hidden so let's download it in our local machine we can do that by using get command okay now if you are familiar with uh, linux command uh, linux then you must know there is no directory with three dots by default so it means it is a directory made by a user so let's see what is what's in there okay so there is an exe file go away dot exe <laughs> go away man okay so there is another folder with three dots so let's see what's in there cool we have two files here one is not for neville and another is a zip file i saved it harry thank you okay we will download that zip file too in our machine great we are done with ftp now so let's see what's inside the files we downloaded so first let's see that uh, hidden file i am hidden it's a message from hagrid you just don't understand do you shoo go away this is probably a dead end huh Hagrid, you just make fun of Dudley Dursley. Okay, another message from Hagrid. Oh, Neville, even I was able to open your secret file. Yeah, now change it before someone gets in. Neville was always a. Uh... Okay, leave it. Let's see if we can unzip that zip file. Okay, of course, it is protected by a password, so we can use uh, F crack zip to brute force the password of this file. So, hyphen D for directory then hyphen u for unzipping the file and then we need to give our word list so we can use uh, hyphen p for password list so we will be using rockyou.txt which is of course famous word list okay user share word list and rockyou.txt and then followed by our zip file 
which is I saved it Harry Dudzip. Okay, it was pretty fast. Password is QWR 1234. Such a lame password, Harry. Okay, now let's see. There is a folder boot, and inside there is a pass file. So let's see. Okay, so looks like it's credential with username Neville and uh, password and some random string. I think we can log in via SSH. Okay, SSH was running on port uh, 9075. So let's try getting Neville. SSH Neville at the rate our IP then followed by our port number yes and the password oops permission denied please try again okay uh, can you tell me why it's happening Okay, permission denied, public password. I tried via FTP but still it wasn't. Okay, the port is 9075, it's correct. Or maybe it has something to do with another HTTP port. Let's see. Port 7899, okay student name, let's try Neville and uh, secret spell, let's try that password, swing wand, wingardium leviosa, okay, okay something is there, shoo now you muggles are not allowed, <laughs> I'm not a muggle aggregate. okay let's try again, 9075 uh, let's try copying the password again oh, okay now I see I earlier I copied space 2 in the password that's why it was giving me error now we are in so we got the shell as Neville so let's see what we find here okay nothing's there in Neville this default files Okay, we have many users, Draco, Harry, Hermione, Neville, Ubuntu, but uh, I I can't log into any of those, I think. Okay, Harry, denied 2. I think it's time for privilege escalation. So we will use uh, find command to find the SUID, capa uh, SUID capability. So let's see. Find type F, permission should be 4000. So devnal is a f uh, null folder it's kind of void or null space okay so there is etc room of requirement okay then if you don't want ping ip you mount so okay ip looks interesting i read it uh, in some other room too so let's see what's in room of requirements oops okay some text is there if you have to ask you will never know if you know you need only ask Helena Ravenclaw the room is located okay Ravenclaw has lost diadem of the Hogwarts castle and has hidden entrance opposite to tips tree okay let's see GTFO bins for IP bin IP if something is there to escalate our privilege okay GTFO bins it's really a helpful site Okay, let's search for IP okay so it's there so it has the SUID binary set so there is a command given IP net ns add foo then IP net ns execute foo bin sh so I think we can get our root shell using those two commands so let's try that Okay, clear our terminal. Okay, it was uh, IP net ns add foo. Okay, then we need to execute our uh, SH shell.
Great, we got the root. You are a wizard, Harry. Let's see now we can get access to all the flags. So first let's start with Draco. Draco Malfi, okay. Achievements.txt. Let's see. So this is our first flag. I unarm Dumbledore. Yeah, I saw. Then let's try Harry. What's in there? Okay, special spell.txt. Let's read it out. Yeah, I swallowed the snitch and 150 points to Gryffindor. Time for you, Hermione. Okay, a spelling error. Let's see what we have here. Okay, special spell.txt again. It's Wingardium Leviosa, Ron. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Okay, now root flag. Headmaster.txt. Albus Dumbledore. Okay, so it's Albus Percival, Wolfic, Brian, Dumbledore. So that's all for today's video. I will see you in the next video. Till then, keep learning.